Hey guys, what is up, Cody here, and welcome back to more Persona 4. Last time we did our fur, or we, uh. Oh, that music! God damn it. Uh, that sad music in the background, it gets me every time. Uh, we had our first fight, our first boss battle with the other Yosuke. Yosuke's other self, I guess. Um, and, uh, I learned some things about battle that's. Um, probably need to remember it will come to my advantage so continuing on oh he's still there You're not me that thing came from you Yosuke he came from you you have to admit it or it'll go berserk again so that's why he attacked him because he didn't accept it hmm Yosuke seems reluctant to accept it. You're still yourself, you have to be- uh, I'm gonna say that. Seems like the most genuine thing to say at the moment. Myself. Yourself. Damn it. Hurts to face yourself. Everyone has to face themselves once in a while. Don't. 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 I was so ashamed that I didn't want to admit it. You're me, and I'm you. When you get down to it, all of this is me. All of it's you. Why the music have to cut off there? The strength of the heart required to face our one's oneself has been made manifest. Magnificent? I don't know. Anyway, there's, yeah, let's just say, yeah, that's, okay, I thought it was going to be a spoiler. That is Yosuke's persona that he just, th that you just saw for a second there. He obtained the facade used to overcome life's hardships. The persona, Jiraiya, 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 I don't know how to pronounce it, but that's Yosuke's persona, Jiraiya. This is my persona. Woo! Why is he squatting like he's gonna take a he crap? <laughs> I wonder if that was something Senpai had been keeping deep down inside. Man, it hurts to receive that information like that. It's almost as bad as getting. is, is breaking up with someone. But is that how you summon your persona? You get on your knees and you start taking a dump? <laughs> he was a real pain in the ass, huh? Man, don't let that quote get to you. What a way to find out. This is so embarrassing. If you weren't here, I don't know what would have happened. Thanks. Thanks, bud. Hey, Teddy. Could Senpai have been attacked by her other self here? Like how it just happened to me? I think so. The shadows here were originally born from humans. <gasps> Sometimes the fog clears, then they all go berserk. And you saw what happens next. A strong-willed shadow draws others to it, and the big mass of shadows kills the host. So that's why people die when it gets foggy in our world. <sighs> Yosuke's pretty worn out. He's a lot more than worn out, this world yo. Isn't made for humans. It's not comfortable for you here. I don't hear any more voices. I think we're done with this place. Good, I'm starting to get a little bored, but at least we're finally getting on with the gameplay. Just have a little more to go, and then we can finally be free. And then it will be blind. Because this Let's Play is going to be m primarily blind. I can assure you that much. Hey, Teddy. You said that this place is reality for people who enter, right? So that shopping district, and the weird room we saw before? Did they exist because the ones who died entered this world and it became their reality? Oh. I guess what I'm trying to ask is, did those places form because of the people who entered this world? Yeah, and I gotta take a piss. I don't know, it's never happened before. Ah, uh, but it's happened but now, twice. where they were when the shadows attacked them. 
Ah. Uh, well, if I were to get attacked, I'd get attacked in the bathroom because I have to take a piss. Nothing. The fog does lift here sometimes. The shadows get really violent then. Oh yeah, really. I always get so scared. I have to hide when it happens. <laughs> yep. Uh, I sensed people here you? twice before, but both of them disappeared after the fog lifted. Yep. <laughs> so let's get this straight. Senpai and that Yamano lady were thrown in here, and since they couldn't get out, they wandered around. You know what? I'm tempted to pee into this, uh, into this. It's like a squirt bottle. And you know what? I'm gonna do it. Oh my god. After a while, that shadow thing came out of them. The fog cleared, it went berserk, and it ended up killing them. Ah, oh, it doesn't fit. On. Oh my god. There we go. Alright, I will be right back. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Does that sound right? Oh yeah, that so sounds if I right. Here until the fog cleared, I would have been in much deeper trouble. Oh, you would have been in deep shit. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Probably shouldn't be drinking so much. You were lucky. Sensei and me were here with you. Damn it, Senpai and that announcer. They were stuck here all alone. No one could save. At least we're here. Yosuke. They disappeared when the fog lifted, but they were safe before that. No shadows attacked them. They attacked us, though. Maybe they're keeping yeah, a they close did. eye on us. They might see people who investigate this place as enemies. It'll be dangerous, but we might be able to fight them. We might save people. We'll become heroes. So what you're saying is we're gonna have to come here again and 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 again gets thrown in here we can save them before they disappear and that's our goal of the game we're gonna keep going to Junos we're gonna keep going to the TV and we're gonna keep saving people one after one like how you guys just saved me ooh I guess it really doesn't matter what we say here it all means the same thing Anyways, we need to catch the one who's throwing people in here and make him stop. Yeah. I'm finally starting to understand what's going on. Uh, um, it, can I ask something too? No, shut up. <laughs> if shadows are born from humans, what was Teddy born from? A, te a, a bear! You don't even know where you came from? How should we know? I know some things, mostly about this world, but mm. I don't know anything about myself. He didn't receive the talk. To be honest, I never thought about it until now. How could you not? Oh, whatever. I'm not gonna Are you question serious? it. Serious? He is serious. No we couldn't get a straight serious. answer out of you. He didn't even know himself. Will you guys come back here? Nope, we're never coming back. Then. Will you keep your promise? Well, you're the one who said you weren't letting us out unless we do. Oh, that's right. Okay, I'll let you out. 
but there's one thing. I'll be waiting for you guys here. Oh, you need to come in sweet. from the same place every time so we can meet up. You could come in from somewhere else, but then you won't end up here. Can we still come here? Depending on where we end you up. You might show up somewhere I couldn't get to you. Then you'd be doomed. Doomed. <laughs> Got it? <laughs> it's well, such a change. Pretty much. All right. Can you show us the way out? Roger that. One exit. Spawn those Coming TVs. Right one hot steamy exit and just kick the floor I wish we could do that cool first we need to make sure there aren't any employees milling around out there okay go 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 Teddy doesn't give no crap about no goddamn employees he doesn't care stop squeezing you little well, oh, sorry, cut him off. <laughs> Whoa! -wee! TVception. It'd really be TVception if you were uh, watching this on your TV, because I'd be recording it, and I'm watching it, and then I'd be recording a recording of a TV that's gonna be seen on a TV by you. I don't know. There's Chi. Chi. <laughs> you guys came back. Huh? Chie? Whoa, what's with that face? She was there the whole time for like almost an hour. Damn. Ow. The nerve of you guys. You are such morons. I wonder what anyone said to her as she was just standing there. And <laughs> She's going to keep doing the same thing over and over again. Dun, 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 I can't dun. believe this. You guys suck. Yeah, we do. The rope got cut <laughs> off, and I had no idea what to do. I was so worried. At least she cares. I mean, scared stiff. Damn it! I hate you both. I love you too. Ah, oh, hey, get back here. I, I think that might have kind of sort of been our fault. Your fault. Maybe we did go a little too far. You went a little too far. Let's apologize to her tomorrow. Tomorrow? I'm wiped out. I'm gonna go home, soak in the shower for a while, and get some sleep. I think hmm. I'm gonna that sleep well nice. tonight. Yeah, you sleep well. Well, see you in the morning. Yeah, I have to take a shower tonight, too. Okay. Is that it? Can I save? Near the flo flood plain while walking home from school. Oh, I don't know what this is. Mm hmm? Yukiko. Mm hmm. Hey, girl. Oh, are you surprised to see me dressed this way? My parents sent me out on an errand. I bet they did. Um, are you getting used to your new town in school? That's not the other thing. <laughs> I want to say I like it here. Really? But because it of must you. be difficult moving to a place you know nothing about. Oh, I'm sure I'll get to know this place a lot. I've never been out of Inaba, so I wouldn't know what it's like to transfer to a new school. Oh, are you getting along with Chie? I mean, I always leave early, so, um... <laughs> She's kind of mad at me right now. <laughs> I see. I could have said the first she one, but that would have been a little... Bit it's of always more. her who gives me the little extra push I need. We had homeroom together last year, too, and I still remember how we'd cut class sometimes. Oh, ho, ho, really? Interesting. I, I should get going. I need to make tomorrow's arrangements with our head chef. Our inn can't function without me right now. 
Um, we'll Look see pretty. You at school then. <laughs> Why was she just st st sitting there in the rain though? That's what I don't get. Alone. Dad's late. No, oh, it's now. Dad's always late. Our next story is an update in our ongoing report on the bizarre murders occurring in Inaba. And At around 7 a.m., local high school student Saki Koyashi was found morning. dead in Inaba's residential area. Why did you have to remind me? Since the body was positioned similarly to the last victim, oh, position. and since Miss Konishi was the one 69. who discovered that body, police are proceeding under the assumption that this may be a serial murder case related to the death of Mayumi Yamano. It's like, it's like the Argonne killing her report hand. has established Miss Konishi's time of death at around 1 a.m. last night. That's early in the, the morning. The body went unnoticed until this morning as a result of the heavy fog blanketing the area. Another yeah. incident. Yeah. Dad won't be coming home tonight. Oh, he comes this game. I'll be here with you, baby. I'll be okay. No, but Can no, you help me do some no. stuff around the house? No, it depends on what. For her age. Amagi Inn, located upstream of Samegawa River, is the town's oldest historical landmark. Mm. Vacationers are known to travel surprising distances in order oh, to visit sure. its open air, radium rich hot springs. Uh -huh. After the incident with Miss Yamano, the manager has stepped aside, leaving her daughter Yukiko to fill her shoes. Yukiko, hey. That's her, she's wearing a kimono. In other words, she's a manager who's still in high school. Dang. Now that has a nice ring to it. Let's see if we can interview her. Excuse me! Hmm? Um, are you speaking to me? <laughs> are you speaking to me? Are you speaking to me? We've heard you you're speaking to me. Is it true you're still in high school? No, I'm in middle school. Oh, well, I'm only filling in temporarily. Uh huh. Someday, That's what they all say. That aside, wow, you're looking gorgeous in that kimono. You must have had a lot of male visitors. <laughs> huh? No. Um. The, it <laughs> looks like an idiot. <laughs> Rambling goes further and further off. So what an idiot. This is boring. Not to me. You better not cheat. No, no, that's oh, Yukiko. I need okay. to do the dishes. <sighs> yeah, I'll help, I guess. Maybe. Yeah, she would probably get on one of those stool stepping stepping stairs stools things to get up to the. And that's what I assume. She's like half her height. So, can we save? Holy crap! And then my game freezes, right? Yes. Alright, hold on. Oh, triangle does the... Okay. I thought it was a uh, start, so maybe I could have went in here. Okay, let me go to the... Here we go. System. Let me turn that off real quick. That's, that's what I was all worried about earlier. I don't like uh, vibration. It goes a lot faster when the, there are two people washing the dishes. Yeah, I bet it does. Can I check the fridge? You open the fridge. There's fried rice. Eat it. Yeah. Eat that fried rice. Some yummy fried rice if you ask me. And you did it. Or did, I don't know. Just eat that fried rice. Yo. Some good. Good stuff right there. No taste at all. What you talking about? Had some really, it was fried rice, man. It has a taste. It's a kitchen. Now I gotta go clean up my mess because I just hit some fried rice. Lunch for tomorrow. Oh, yeah. But we're not gonna be able to do that. Uh, check that memory card. Yo. Let me save up. You know that. Seven. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 12 how many? How many files can you have? 22, 23, 24, 25, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Hold on, I'm not done. I want to check because I'm very curious. Come on. Come on, load faster. 16. That's that's lame. Oh, that's what we're doing next time. The Midnight Channel. Check it later, player.